computer, admit, start video, did I get everybody? Let me make sure I don't have anybody waiting. I um, think I've got everybody. Uh, so, um, hey, welcome to Thursday, fourth period, Foundation Arts. Um, I'm gonna go over what you're doing today. Today um, is a work day for some people that haven't um, finished their uh, Keith Herring um, project. So, here we are in fourth period, and if you go to your announcements, I made a couple of announcements today. Um, one of the announcements, as has been this entire six weeks, is your sketch assignment. Um, also, here's your Zoom link, and then in a little bit, I will also put the recorded YouTube video up there in case anybody needs to rewatch it. But your sketchbook assignment today is to design, create, draw a haunted house. And I just posted a example below. Um, so that's your sketch for the day. Remember that all four of your sketches are due tomorrow. Um, after you have tomorrow's sketch, you'll have four. You have Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. And I'm now going to go to the assignment page. Oh wait, no, I'm gonna retell you um, some things. I added additional information today. And it just says that today's a work day for you to continue working on your Keith uh, Herring Design Social Issue Project. Please see the project in your assignment section labeled Keith Herring. I'll show you that again. Sometimes people get confused where things are. Below are some, some just some more images of Herring Social Issue artwork to inspire you. And I would love for these to be completed in color. Um, I know those of you that are at home virtually might, may or may not have um, color pencils or markers or crayons. Hopefully you have something that you could color these really hard so they're really bold. Um, but if not, uh, obviously, you know, just using your pencil will be fine. But I really would like these to be in a, in a bold color. Remember, you're just kind of, you know, in your sketchbook, these don't have to be big. You're kind of just making a small little little poster uh, of kind of, you know, Keith Herring's artwork. So I was just gonna show you a couple more. This is, you know, like a, a person holding, you know, kind of holding a baby, um, you know, is that, you know, saying something like, you know, pro-life, uh, pro-adoption, uh, you know, I mean, there's all kinds of, you know, ways. I don't know particularly what that's saying, you know, but that's some sort of image. You could even, um, Keith Herring likes to, he does his really cool dog images, so, you know, if you were doing something with animal rights or something, you know, instead of that baby, it could be a dog or a dog and a cat or anything, um, the world. Um, so, so that was really cool. And then this is the one I was trying to find yesterday. Um, it says crack down. Um, and it's very visually perfect because it's a foot stepping on what would be some sort of paraphernalia, you know, I guess like a glass paraphernalia, something another. And then two people holding it with X's on them, basically, because they're dead and, you know, crack has, has you know, killed them. Um, this was done in 1986. And, you know, I'm sure if Keith Haring was still alive today, he would be just shocked with the our opioid um, issues that we have countrywide. Uh, I don't even know worldwide, but I know at least here in the United States. Um, here's a couple of other ones. Um, Save the bees, you know, it's got a little Keith Haring figure and a heart and, you know, these little sad bees. If we, if we lose honeybees, something dealing with the, I'm not a biology person, not quite sure why, but if we lose the bees, you know, that something eventually would destroy humans is my take on it. Um, so uh, that's kind of a kind of cool little social issue. And then down here at the bottom, there's one that says silence equals death and you know fight up fight against aids like i said he was in the the mid 80s mid to late 80s when hiv and aids and everything was just coming out and and people weren't talking about it and having awareness and and being protected and so he um did a lot of imagery that that was you know to help uh bring awareness to diseases and taking care of yourself and 
Um, but you could easily do this whole, you know, see no evil, hear no evil, speak no evil, um, which is where all that hand stuff comes from, from many, um, many type of uh, bullying, you know, bullying would be perfect. Sometimes we see people getting bullied or we see it on social media or we hear it and, you know, we don't speak up. We should speak up more. We should take care of people more. We should, you know, check on people more. So I just wanted to show that to you, um, just a little bit of extra information. And then I'm just going to show you where your assignment is located. Again, it's under assignments and my page is obviously different than yours. There it is. So it says Keith Herring. I have a due next Tuesday. Obviously you might get it done in the next couple of days. I just didn't want to put anybody on a rush with it, especially if you were taking your time and researching some, some um, uh, social issues, you can click on things. This says how to draw Herring's images. So here again is how to draw one of his figures, just draw a stick figure and then draw like a, an outline around it. It also shows um, some of his common um, themes that he used in his artwork. There's the baby and the dog. Um, uh, and then, of course, his basic uh, designs that he uses in, in different places, the movement lines. Um, so that's there to help you. And then um, also in that same assignment block is a slide presentation on Keith Haring and kind of your assignment, where your assignment is. So down below right here is a slide presentation about him and his artwork. You can click through that. And then this particular one, it deals a little more with your project. Um, this is small here, but I think you could read it in, on the computer. Saying that you're gonna design, you know, a Keith inspired, a Keith Herring inspired image, um, you know, depicting a social media. And um, I showed these images yesterday. I just wanted to go over it again for everybody. I gave, I gave you homelessness. I forgot homelessness yesterday, poverty. I forgot a lot of stuff to say yesterday. Suicide, discrimination, depression. Uh, there's so many things going on, especially now with COVID. And, you know, we have a, there's a lot of issues. So there's many things that you could depict. You might want to do more than one. Um, uh, and then here again, how to draw, you know, just being, you could do, you could do a, just being nice, showing compassion, like, you could draw two Keith Haring figures and one's, you know, handing some flowers to somebody or handing, you know, a bag lunch or something like maybe you're helping to feed, you know, somebody that's hungry. These are all, you know, ideas that you could use for this project. And then obviously world peace. So today is just a work day for you um, to continue uh, working on your Keith Haring inspired social project, social issue project and to work on drawing your haunted house. So um, I can't wait to see all these sketches tomorrow. Um, I've tried to have some of it uh, Halloween related. And um, I'm going to stop live recording. And then um, I think to, hold on, I'm gonna stop.